Success Megatron. Yes, Soundwave! That must be the source of the rare energy detected by our Earth scanners. Then let's get to its core and drink its power dry! I give the orders here, Starscream! The energy could be dangerously unstable. Soundwave, send an auto scout into the crevice. Auto scout activated. It is programmed to analyze and report. Well, Soundwave? Energy emanates from crystalline structures. Describe more fully. Crystalline structures are quartz-like and packed with layers of multicolored rods. Colonium crystals. The most rare and dangerous form of raw energy in this solar system. Do not permit the auto scout to make contact. Those crystals are deadly. I've never heard of Corlonium crystals. It's just such ignorance which forever relegates you to the ranks of underlings, Starscream. I warn you, stay well back. Corlonium crystals destroy electronic circuitry on the slightest contact. Then let's trick Optimus Prime into leading his Autobots into this crevice. Optimus Prime would never do anything so foolish. At least not the real Optimus Prime. The real Optimus Prime? What do you mean? You shall see. The Autobots will soon detect the crystal energy and come to investigate. And I shall be waiting for them. In my temporary base of operations. Those weird lights are coming from that crevice, Optimus Prime. It doesn't make any sense. Wow! Those lights are hotter than a Cybertronic laser flare. Man, if I could put on a light show that cool, I'd dazzle multitudes of music lovers. Hot, cool, or whatever. While you motorized mumblers talk, I'm gonna check out those lights. Take some readings first, Cliffjumper. The source of those lights could be dangerous. All the danger you can handle is already here, Flopdemus Prime! Starscream, it's a trap! Brilliant deduction! Decepticons, fire! Yeah! I'm sorry, there are only three of you. Clobbering less than four Decepticons at a time is boring. You won't be bored for long, Optimus Prime. Soundwave, eject laser beak. Target, Optimus Prime. Laser beak, you tinfoil turkey. Laser beak, hold your fire! I want holographic views of Optimus Prime from every angle, but do not harm him. <laughs> the Autobots themselves will punish him for us when the time is right. <laughs> Excellent! The fallen gladiator is very photogenic. Transmit holograms. Perfect. Now to begin the cloning process. It is Optimus Prime. Nonsense! This is a clone of our enemy. A perfect replica down to the last transistor. But there is one important difference. I control this Optimus Prime. I am Optimus Prime. I am Optimus Prime. Leader of the Autobots. Leader of the Autobots. And at Megatron's command. And at Megatron's command. I will, I will lead, lead them, them to their, their doom. doom. Optimus! You okay? I will be. Must have jarred my equilibrium chips in the fall. 
but they're stabilized. Now, let's finish these Decepticons. Hey, perfect timing! The creeps are retreating! Autobots, transform! Return to headquarters! I must have blacked out. Where is everybody? Bumblebee, come over here. The computer's not responding to my input. Bumblebee, I'm speaking to you. You talking to me? Of course. But uh, I'm not Bumblebee, I'm Ironhide, Bram. I meant Ironhide, naturally. Tell me, when was Teletran 1 checked out? It isn't working properly. You did that yourself this morning, Optimus, and you're punching the wrong controls. Something's very wrong with Optimus Prime. You're telling me. Prime, what's wrong with you? You're acting like you don't know any of us, like you don't even know your way around. What? It was the fall. I, I told you it rattled my circuitry. The outer perimeter alarm! But all Autobots are already inside. Let's punch up the entry scanner so we can see who... What the? It's Optimus Prime! Amazing. He looks exactly like me. Let him in. But... He's obviously a Decepticon imposter. As soon as he's within range, shoot him down. Now, Autobots, destroy the imposter! The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. No! Hold your fire! No shooting until we're sure who's for real and who isn't. Well... It looks like you all made it back safely. I'm relieved. And where have you been all this time, Prime? Laserbeak attacked, and I fell into a ravine, and... What's going on? Is this some kind of game? I'm afraid it's no game. He says he's Optimus Prime. Which would mean that I'm an imposter. You can't talk your way out of this one. Every Autobot knows I am the genuine Optimus Prime. Teletran, you're the only one who can tell us. Which Optimus Prime is Optimus Prime? Detailed comparison forthcoming. Both subjects identical. Therefore, both are Optimus Prime. But there can only be one real Prime. We've got to set up some tests of our own. I welcome, I welcome the, the challenge. challenge. This will be a test of laser raffle sharpshooting. Hit that stone slab at the top of the cliff, then make it ricochet to that exact spot marked X. Then ricochet back up again to that same stone. Piece of chrome alloy cake, huh? Take your positions and fire when ready. You may go first. Oh, it's your... Well, it seems this contest is already over. They just don't make rocky overhangs like they used to. Okay, we'll settle this with a race. Ready? Transform! Gee... Even their transforms are the same. Now, first one to the other side of the flats and back is the winner. On your marks, go! Uh, what happened to Ready and Get Set? Uh, I got so excited, I, I guess I forgot. 
They're raising so much dust, I can't see who's winning. Stand aside, here they come. What took you so long? I guess we struck out on the tests. Hey guys, Teletran 1 reports more activity at the energy crevice. The lights are glowing more and more intensely. I'll say. They're reaching critical temperature. We gotta stop that reaction before the whole area explodes. <laughs> These energy amplifiers are giving Teletran 1 exactly the wrong readings, which are just the right readings to lure the Autobots back to the crevice and their doom. <laughs> Autobots, hold it. Until we get your identities unscrambled, I'll give the orders. Autobots, transform. Roll out for the energy crevice. Autobots, transform. Be on guard. We could be heading into another Decepticon trap. We'll spring any traps that need to be sprung. Did someone mention traps? I don't mind hitting the dirt, <laughs> but I don't enjoy eating it. <laughs> the Autobots are gloriously confused. We shall crush them once and for all. Not yet. They must be willing to follow my Prime clone into that crevice. He must win their complete trust, and to do that, he must destroy one of us. Yes, yes! Destroying a Decepticon will convince the Autobots your replica is the real Optimus Prime! Exactly! And do you have any idea which Decepticon will be brave enough to make that sacrifice? It should be a trusted officer to make it look really good. Precisely. <laughs> Which is why I've decided on you. I? Starscream? The pride of the Cybertron War Academy? Never! Do you hear me? Never! Soundwave. Eject laser beak. Bring Starscream back without delay. Windcharger, look! Laserbeak and Starscream, they came out of the mountainside. It looks like Laserbeak's chasing Starscream. Then let's find out why. We'll check out that mountainside. They seem to come right out of it. You're not taking me back! I refuse to sacrifice myself! There's got to be a way in, because this is where they came out. Quick, Spike! Duck! Your cowardice prevented you from hearing me out, Starscream! I am planning to have my clone of Optimus Prime destroy your clone, not you! After that show of leadership, the Autobots will follow the false prime into the energy crevice and certain doom. <laughs> no! It doesn't even tickle my transistors! Very handsome, if I say so myself. Will it be as brave as I in battle? Brave? Well, let's say, as obedient, because you will be controlling all of its actions. Now the time has come for Starscream to sacrifice himself in battle. As you command, Megatron. It's Laserbeak! Run, Wind Charger! Wow! The 
Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. Fortunate than your Autobot friend, puny human. He no longer exists. Soundwave, let the boy come closer. I want him to watch his friends being led to their doom in the crevice of light. Not a chance, Mega Rat. The Autobots won't be played for suckers. You and your Decepticoons will lose. Not this time. And once we have dispensed with Optimus Prime and the Autobots, we will dispose of you! Now watch! Quite an interesting little drama, isn't it? Jazz! Hit the deck! I want a clean shot at Starscream! <laughs> Marvelous! I have written a brilliant scenario of Autobot destruction. Not quite as brilliant as it would be if I were there myself to wipe out Optimus Prime. But that is not Optimus Prime, you dynamical don't! This is your cue, Starscream. Say your line. Decepticons! Autobots! Hold your fire! Did you have a blowout in your brain box, Starscream? I've got an Autobot, right? I said, hold your fire! I challenge the leader of the Autobots, the great Optimus Prime, to a one-on-one -on -one battle to the finish! How are you gonna know which one to take on? Nah, this is the one that I will destroy! All right, so what happens when one of you wins? The loser! And his troops must leave the area immediately and forever. Agreed. Let's get on with it. Then let the contest begin. Autobots, this Prime just destroyed the Decepticon's number two varmint. He can't be working for Megatron. Which means he must be the real Optimus Prime. What are your orders, Prime? Follow me, Autobots, into the crevice. We've got to investigate the source of those energy emissions. Ironhide, Wheeljack, Trailblazer, Autobots, all of you, do not follow him. Hey, man. The real Optimus Prime wouldn't chicken out on a little recon operation. Right. We follow him. Wheelcharger, you are in the crevice? Then this is Optimus Prime, and he is telling us the truth. The crevice is safe. No way! The only reason I survived is because I transformed before I landed on a heap of coronium crystals. Those crystals destroy all electronic parts on contact. But when you transformed, your rubber tires insulated you. Exactly. You're being led into a trap set by Megatron, who's also got Spike. Pure drivel. Megatron has obviously reprogrammed Windcharger's logic circuits to mislead you all. There is nothing that will harm us in the crevice. Now follow me and we'll give Megatron a taste of his own medicine. But what about Spike? He's unimportant. Follow me. Forget the crystals, Autobots. Now we know which Prime is Prime. The real one would save Spike. Yeah, even if we never get those weird crystals. So you're the phony. That's what I've been trying to tell you. He's an evil clone, an empty shell. Autobots, destroy the imposter. No, do not! No! My magnificent creation! 
nation vaporized! With Prime's replica destroyed, we must escape now! Faster, before they run for it! From one ship to another. No big deal! I'm sorry, I couldn't hang on to Megatron, guys. Oh, don't worry, Spack. We'll nail him next time. Is it really you, Optimus Prime? I mean, really? Yes, Spike. This time I am definitely me. Or I. Myself. Or whoever I am. Put her there, partner. The Transformers will return after these messages.